care home workers caught abusing woman, 71, when daughters set up spy camera. A woman was dragged by her wrists from her bed, refused meals and ignored when she asked to go to the toilet, a court heard. Joy Lewis, 71, who has Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease, was left sitting in urine despite begging her care workers to change her at Brookside House Care Home in Nottinghamshire. Her abuse was only discovered when Joy's daughters set up a secret camera in her room to capture evidence of the cruel treatment. The CCTV and stills from video was used in court when the carers involved, Rebecca King, 32, Teresa Cutts, 50 and Joanne Hardstaff, 39, admitted charges of ill treatment or neglect. They all received suspended sentences and community orders at Mansfield Magistrates Court last month. Joy's daughters are now calling for CCTV to be compulsory in all care homes and for tougher sentences for the crime. To view this video please enable JavaScript, and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video eldest daughter Teresa Bestwisk, 47, told the Sunday Mirror, we feel angry their sentences were suspended. They only pleaded guilty because it was all on tape. Kelly Lewis, 34, Joy's youngest daughter, confronted the carers at the home after her mother told her the staff didn't like her and isolated her from other residents. They assured Kelly her mother was happy and just confused. But during later visits to the home, she noticed her mother's condition had worsened and that she was bruised. She set up a clock camera in her mother's room and recorded for two days. When she watched it back and heard the carers swearing at a male resident who had wet himself. Later in the footage they saw their mother being woken up in the early hours of the morning, pulled out of bed by her wrists and dressed without being washed. Her pleas to use the toilet were ignored and she was left for hours at a time without food and drink. Anyone who can treat another person like that is a vile creature. Watching the footage, seeing mum crying, was heartbreaking, Kelly said. She was crying her eyes out, sobbing, begging for basic things, saying she was frightened of dying. No one at the home came to comfort her. It was terrible. King received a 36-week suspended prison sentence and was ordered to complete 120 hours of unpaid work. Cuts received a 24-week suspended prison sentence and was ordered to complete 100 hours of unpaid work. Hardstaff received an eight-week suspended prison sentence and ordered to complete 80 hours of unpaid work. Brookside House has since been closed and Joy has been moved into a new care home, where she is said to be much happier. Three-month heat wave has Brits hoping for hottest summer and 12 years man banned for life for bringing blow-up doll on flight to a visa heartbroken family say girl, 4, found dead at home was beautiful inside and out.